In the lobby of Ramsey Solutions, Troy is with us. Hey, Troy, how are you? I'm doing amazing, Dave. How are you? Wow, I'm honored. It's good to have you, sir. Where do you live? I live in Jacksonville, Florida. Born and raised. Very fun. Good for you. And you're here to do your debt-free scream. Absolutely. Very cool. And how much have you paid off? Paid off $42,000. I love it. And how long did that take you? 24 months. Very cool. And what do you do for a living? I'm a web application developer for a marketing firm, and I also have a side business business where I do voiceovers. Good for you. Good for you. And, and your income range? Uh, it ranged uh, from $50,000 uh, at the start uh, to 68000 at the end. And uh, from the side business, I also right now doing about 75000 Wow. Wow. Yeah. Well, that's nice. It is. The side business has taken over. It has. It's, it's it. done pretty well for me. Wonderful. Well, congratulations. Very well done. So tell me your story. What happened 24 months ago? Well, I actually have to go back a little bit further than that. Um, when I was, I was pretty much a bum, just living at my uh, parents' house, you know, playing video games all day. Basically, no, no prospects whatsoever. I then decided to go back to college because I was pushed to by my family. Mm -hmm. And when I second I stepped on campus, I was like, you know what? This is your last shot. You're going to be working minimum wage for the rest of your life if you don't make this one happen. Mm. I made it happen. I actually graduated valedictorian. Wow. Yes. Yes. I mean, and, and if you knew me before that, that was like unfathomable. Wow. I mean, <laughs> but I and, actually and had, what, what, what degree did you get? Uh, it was a degree in web design and development ah. uh, that I then uh, took to uh, get a job with. Okay. And then, so I'm seeing this paycheck that has an extra zero at the end of it because mm -hmm. I'd never seen that type of money before in my life. And I was like, okay, well then I need to do right by this. Mm -hmm. So I immediately go onto the, onto the online and like start looking up everything I can about personal finance. Mm -hmm. I read every single blog, read every single book, every single audio book. And through that, I happened to find you mm -hmm. and your plan. And mm -hmm. I was like, this guy knows what he's talking about. Mm. He knows his stuff. So I was like, okay, I'm going to put this plan to work. And it worked for me, and here I am. There you go. And yeah. 24 months later, yeah. you're debt-free. Absolutely. Uh, apparently, you can do anything you set your mind to, huh? That's the thing. You know, that's what I didn't realize before. But it's like, you know, you set your mind to it, you set yourself with a, up with a goal, you can make anything happen. So uh, was it your mom or your dad that threw you out? <laughs> Nobody threw me out. <laughs> you're a little too big to be thrown out, but yeah. Uh, well, I don't know if they can pick me up to throw me out. Uh, <laughs> Um, but yeah, my, my mom pushed me to go back, you know, and she, and she did it nicely. You know, yeah. it, it was with, you know, it was, it was a great Honey, you love. have too much potential to be a couch potato. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah right. That was pretty much it. Yeah. That yeah. was the conversation. <laughs> okay. Very cool. Well, she was obviously right. Yeah, she was. And congratulations <laughs> to her for, uh, for, for pushing the eagle out of the nest and making him fly. <laughs> Absolutely. Very well done. How old are you now? I'm 32. 32. So uh, you started this journey when you were 30, as yes. far as the debt goes. That's right. And when did you go back to school? At what age? I went back to school at 28. At 28. Okay. So boom, boom. Just yep. click, click, click. Here we go. Mm -hmm. So the 42000 was what? What uh, kind of debt? That was uh, student loans, a uh, credit card, mm -hmm. and a personal loan that I don't even remember what it was for. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's, uh, people have had those before, I'll just tell you. So, uh, so how does it feel now that I mean you've had so much accomplishment in your life in the last four years and one of those things is to knock this debt out but I mean you you got, you got a lot of traction in your life don't you yep so far yeah it's, it, this is just the beginning like I'm I'm looking forward to the future and I'm like it's it's so open now mm -hmm. you know it's like I've I've crack down the door and now I can go anywhere. Mm -hmm. And then all I needed was that little push from my mom. And, mm -hmm. you know, thank you, mom. Appreciate it. There you go. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good stuff. Very well done. So, uh, if, if there's a, um, a young person out there that whose mom has not thrown them, I mean, uh, suggested they leave, um, out there, uh, talk to them about what you've been through and, and how it changed the whole chemistry of who you are. Well, actually, I have been talking to them. I just recently gave a uh, financial talk at my alma mater, speaking to uh, college students, ah. teaching them how not to do what I did, which is waste your life, mm -hmm. and how to get out of debt, and just realize that you don't have to have those student loans for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, get rid of those as soon as possible. And, I mean, it just, it just opens up so many opportunities for you. So I'm speaking to them. They're asking me questions, and then like they're treating me like I'm the financial expert. I'm like, mm -hmm. well, how did this happen? You know? mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. How did we get here? But I mean, you can do it. It's just about setting your mind to it. So, what are the keys to getting out of debt that you use? What do you think the things that allowed you to do this? Forty-two thousand paid off in twenty-four months. 
The one thing is that I, I think back to a quote that you made, and it was, the rich know the same things you and I know, but the difference is they do it. And I did it. I just put it into practice. Because everybody out here, everybody listening to this show right now knows exactly how to get out of debt. Everybody knows exactly how to get financial freedom. The problem is, is almost nobody does it. If you just, like, just listen and take my example or anyone's example who's gotten out of debt, I mean, just live on less than you make. Have a plan. You know, don't borrow money. It's, I mean, it's really that simple. And if, as long as they put it into practice, they can go wherever they need to. Yep. There you go. Yep. It's, it really is not rocket science. It really is so easy to understand. And, you know, I think that's what trips people up because they want something complicated. Absolutely. And some of the most profound life-changing things that you'll ever learn in your life are simple to understand mm -hmm. but very hard to do because they involve you changing the man in the mirror. Absolutely. And uh, that's what you've done. Right. Um, you, you know, you, you left the couch and went out here and completely changed your whole life. I, I'm, you are a hero, man. I'm so proud of you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate Very well done. I know your mom and dad are proud of you. Yeah. Valedictorian, <laughs> debt-free, all in a series of four years. Very cool. Very cool. I think we need to hire you to do web apps for us, buddy. <laughs> need to move you up here from Jacksonville. Sounds all good. right. Okay. So we're going to give you a copy of Chris Hogan's new number one best-selling book. Retire Inspired, signed by him, because that's your next step. Build yes. wealth and be outrageously generous, and you'll be right on that path. I, I can see that coming. So very proud of you, Troy. Congratulations. Thank you, Dave. Very good job. Troy from Jacksonville, Florida, $42,000 paid off in 24 months, making 50 to 68. Oh, and the little side job that makes 75K. So count it down. Let's hear a debt-free scream. Three, two, one. I'm dead free. <laughs> and the crowd in the lobby goes wild. I love it. That was great, Troy. Very good talking to you, man. That's inspiring stuff right there. Hey, I meet millennials that are that guy everywhere. Now, everybody gives these millennials a hard knock. I got a whole bunch of them working in this building, and they're that guy. They know they can spell initiative. They they believe in capitalism. They they believe in hard work and discipline to win. I I meet these people. I, I you know I, I see them everywhere. Now I know there's a percentage of these millennials that are just you know socialist Bernie followers. I get that, but, but I got to tell you that's not most of them. I don't even know if it's half of them. I'm not, I don't know what the numbers are, but I, I see enough of that kind that I got a lot of hope for the future of this country. I really do. Now, you wouldn't get hope necessarily from the political cycle, but you can meet Troy. I mean, valedictorian, man. I mean, guy's a stud. He's a stud, man. Did you see that? I mean, that guy's incredible. That's awesomeness. And so, you're, you know, you're listening to me, you're 25 years old, you're 24 years old, you're 27 years old, and, and you haven't done anything. Well, now's your day, man. He just told you. He went, he just got up off the couch, went and changed his whole life. He put the Nintendo down and went, you know, put Halo down and went to work, man. You know, and unless you are a gamer for a living, there's no money in that crap, you know. But what, at valedictorian in web design and gaming didn't have anything to do with that, I'll just tell you. Man, what, those people are incredible. You can do this stuff. You can do this stuff. The secrets of the rich are not secrets. <laughs> the secret is that no, just what he said. Nobody does it. Normal is broke. Normal is broke. Don't be normal. Just decide. You live in the richest country the world has ever known. Don't be normal. This is the Dave Ramsey Show. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button to get the latest content and check out these other great clips from the show. You can do this. You know, that really is a message. Whether you've got $270,000 in student loan debt or $27,000, whether you've got a $50,000 income or a $500,000 income, 